All right, we're going to unbox this Spartan or Striker Troop <laughs> for the British. And I'm joined by Stephen. Hello. And this is his box we're going to be unboxing. And Arthur's here. Yo. So let's get this off. Oh, now see, these feel like plastic. The last couple I did were resin and metal, and they were pretty hefty. These are, oh, it does say all plastic. Duh. Okay, so. So you can make two different types of vehicles and also one of them could be the HQ. I think if you take that missile off, it's your, you could use it as your HQ for the re recon or recce. Oh, I wonder what those are. Okay. So here we are. Wow. That's a lot of parts <laughs> for this vehicle. <laughs> okay. So here's Striker, and they're telling you what parts to use the green. Oh, this is pretty nice. I like this. Yeah. I do like this. So the orange Tells you what parts to use, and if you're doing this, you use the, it's kind of a purplish blue, maybe a royal blue. I do like that. And you get four in your choice. One, two, three. Oh, there's the blowpipe also then. Wow, so you get a lot of choices off this one. One decal sheet and six unit cards, because there's four, and one of them's going to be HQ. Mm, yeah. I just don't know what the... That'd be five. I don't know what the sixth one would be. So you got Might your have two of one. Might be. So I didn't see anything about magnets, so I'm feeling pretty confident about this unboxing. Well, I think it's they all plastic. <laughs> <laughs> but you know, you can glue, you can magnetize the turrets and stuff. I but think I they only give magnets to aircraft. I haven't seen any like tanks that they actually have a magnet in them. Oh, hold off on that. Let's look at the sprue here. Oh my gosh, this is, this is so, if this is the length of the vehicle, which I think it is, this is so small. I'll get a tank up here for comparison. It's well, got some nice detail. Well, it looks only like the first half. There's at the length of it right there. So I think you put, I guess one of, you put one of these back here. Mm. Which you which do you want to do? You got a couple of guns there. There's your commander sp commander. This reminds me of the M109. The other side. So I'm going to get my T72, and we'll look at the length here of this. Um, yeah. <laughs> I think the M109 would be closer. Well, we still got your M113, or was, yeah. Oh, yeah, we have M113, well, okay. well, I'm Okay. Uh, 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 <laughs> British stuff is so small. I mean, this looks small on the table when you get tanks going. Now I'm looking at this going, oh my. Compared to the, the other part of it. This? Yeah. It's still small. Yeah, but not by much yeah. compared to what this looked like, but still, it's a lot smaller. So you get four of those. You get, I'm kind of really curious what, this must be like the missiles and I'm thinking like maybe those parts or something. Let's see what these are. These, um, oh, these are men. Okay. So these, oh, okay, I see the guy right there. So these are the men. Let's see what kind of detail we got here. Focus in. I don't know about the face on this one compared to some of the things I've seen. Well, this is plastic, not resin, correct? Yeah, yeah. this one. Well, I don't know. This may be resin. Well, I guess it's a little bit lighter than the regular plastic. But Does he have a helmet? Yeah, and they got like some netting. Uh, like they put strips. Oh, okay. From what I read, so. So yeah, this is the guy that sticks out of the hatch. You get four of those guys, one for each of them, if that's the vehicle you want to do. Um, let's see, we got stickers and cards. Ah, here's one of the cards. Oh wait, that would be the commander though. Okay, so let's see about the stickers here. 
Okay, these are different than the ones I've seen before. So you get some unit markings, some numbers. What does that say? SBD, SBC, 4BC, oh, it's 5, I guess. Okay, so you get some numbering. All right. Oh, so the division card. Okay, see, I was not expecting this. Yeah. Because it's this, this, yeah, this is the HQ is one of those, uh, what was it, a Spartan? Yeah, I, I forget that with the HQ, not only do you get the HQ card, you get the division card as well. Yep. So here's the Spartan MCT. I wonder if M stands for Milan. No, it's probably a 17 uh, word acronym. <laughs> and I bet this is troop, even though, or, or, no, it should be say tanks. That's what it should say. Okay, there's your HQ, which is a Spartan. What's his skill level? Uh, what's his skill level? A two. Yeah. Scout team has gone to ground. That's one of the nice things about when they're this recon stuff, a lot of stuff has gone to ground if they don't shoot. So you can move mm -hmm. around the table and it's going to be like fives or sixes to hit you. But if you do get hit, you're in trouble. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they do have thermal imaging, which is nice. Well, it makes sense for Scout. If you go out there and see what's around there, you should have the best vision stuff. Oh, a transport. That's that one. And then finally, the blowpipe, which is interesting vehicle because this is the first one I've ever seen they did this to, mm -hmm. where you got the AA missile or against vehicles and infantry. I don't think I've ever seen any others in the game that's like that. Let me move the men up here. So that is everything you get in the Spartan or Striker troop, which is actually a blowpipe also. So there's more than what's on the cover there.